Welcome everybody to another great edition of Josh and Around Milwaukee presented by Drink Wisconsibly and Visit Milwaukee. I'm Josh Albrecht and I'm here at the beautiful... And I'm also Grand Josh Albrecht from 97.3 The Game. That's right. He's Josh Albrecht and I'm Josh Albrecht. And we're Josh and Around Milwaukee bringing you all the cool new places and all the tr great traditional places that are, make up this wonderful city of Milwaukee. We are here today at the Roundhouse Beer Garden uh, here on the beautiful shores of Lake Michigan and we're excited to try their pretzels, their beer, their boozy slushies and all the other cool things that are happening on this brand new beer garden in Milwaukee. So come and join us as we have a lot of fun today and maybe learn a few things. Two Joshes and their claim to fame. Two crazy dudes with identical names. Two Joshes having some fun. Two Joshes are better than one. Two Joshes just joshing around. Two crazy dudes in a wonderful town. Two Joshes having some fun. Two Joshes are better than one. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two Joshes having some fun. Cause two Joshes are better than one. We are joshing around Milwaukee and we've taken a pit stop here at the beautiful Roundhouse Beer Garden here on the beautiful shores of Lake Michigan. And uh, again, I found myself saying the word beautiful too much, Josh. I don't think you can say enough. I know, because we're in Milwaukee. And it's beautiful out. It is absolutely beautiful out. Perfect day for a beer garden and a perfect day for a special guest. We have Anna Barlotta here, who is uh, basically, you are all things Roundhouse. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Is that your just, title? Just the manager. <laughs> yes. But I am when it comes to uh, changing kegs, switching out CO2. You know, I, I do it all. It's part of the hospitality industry is that... Uh, no matter if you're on the, the front lines, you're in the back of the kitchen, your management, your owner, and hospitality, you're doing everything. Oh yeah, 100%. You can't, uh, you're never immune to rolling up your sleeves and cleaning out a clogged drain, that's for sure. Yeah, yeah. but uh, you know, the great thing about it, uh, a beer garden though, is it's all about camaraderie, it's about people coming together, having a few laughs, having a few beers, which we've got uh, some mm. great beer here today, yes, and some beautiful root beer. Yes, cheers uh, to that. And so it's a great place to come together, have some fun, and it's all about that hospitality. And isn't that what Milwaukee's all about? Yes, yes, I love it. I, you know, I recently moved back from out of state and I folks just don't realize like how fantastic that is you know just a just a warm feeling when you're here welcoming people in making them feel like they're coming into your own living room um, in this beautiful city yeah and so that's I mean let, tell us a little bit about the the concept behind the roundhouse is, yeah. it, is it trying to get people to say hey imagine if your backyard was on the uh, shore of Lake Michigan right <laughs> yeah and, and really that's what it is for the city of Milwaukee it's fantastic so um, we are a beer garden. We have beers on tap. We have sandwiches, a uh, big Bavarian Beast pretzel from Milwaukee Pretzel Company. Um, so really a lot of fantastic things that Milwaukee has to offer uh, showcased here. So we try to use uh, local uh, purveyors whenever we can. Uh, we have Clock Shadow Creamery, um, always local beer, if not to Milwaukee, certainly uh, Wisconsin. We got the Sprecher Root Beer there, real Absolutely. Wisconsin honey. And uh, I mean, Pete's Pops, what could, I mean, everything. Any, yeah. Anything we could try to pack in here to showcase the city we tried. Is there a, a special Pete's, Pete's Pops for this location? Uh, you know what? That's a great Did idea. Not, like I, not I, yet, I gotta there call will be. Up. <laughs> I gotta call them up. We just got some new flavors in today. We have root beer float, one of my uh, oh, nice. favorites uh, and uh, orange dreamsicle delicious yeah. can't go wrong really great stuff I mean that, uh, the, the 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 legacy of uh, of Bartolotta so mm -hmm. it's, uh, the roundhouse is operated by the Bartolotta restaurant group yes. yep uh, yourself being a Bartolotta yeah food's gotta be important yes so I've, I've heard that's important what's the, in your family what's the special that? thing what's what, what am I eating when I come here yeah certainly uh, so we have a great lineup of sandwiches uh, sausages for you so we have a great club sandwich um, today we're gonna be trying out the brat Johnsonville Ooh. brat again highlighting uh, Wisconsin yeah. and then we have a boar's head hot dog it's a quarter pounder hot dog we're not messing around I uh, love it Worked really hard on getting the bun to meat ratio perfect there. Bun to uh, very yeah. important. Yeah, I, this I, is science. I really feel like the food should be here right now. Oh, are, are you able to make that happen? Hold on. I agree. All Hold right. on, All I right. can do this. Hold on. Okay. Wow. And it's 
Oh my gosh. How'd you do here. that? How'd you do that? Oh, you did a great job, Josh. Let me try. Awesome. It's here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Evie, thank you. Our, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Wow. Look at so that. You weren't, you weren't, you were not kidding, Josh. Yeah. Here's a nice hot dog wow. coming your way. Yeah. Uh, that's got to be something special. Yes, certainly. So this is a quarter pounder hot dog uh, from Boar's Head. Uh, we worked really hard on uh, sourcing one that we thought was going to really hold up to that beer garden name. Um, so we're actually using uh, Greeby's uh, hot dog buns as well. We found that nice. it yielded the perfect bun to meat ratio. It's a uh, pretzel bun? Yes, and pretzel bun as well. So we have two options for you, plain or pretzel. Oh, are you shocked? This is, a, oh, this is Bartolotta we're talking about here. I'm just here. having to look at this. I know, Not eat it yet. I know, beautiful. Um, but yeah, we steam the buns uh, in the bag so they get nice and soft. Uh, it, you know, like like I said before, a lot of science goes into it, a lot yeah. of trial and error. I love it. Um, tough d job, but somebody's got to do it. Yeah, if you ever need taste testers. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll Noted. Have you come back. We'll 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 test taste test anything. All right. Very right. true. Be careful we will. Who you sign up for because I don't know if you've seen Matilda, <laughs> but that uh, chocolate right. cake yeah. scene that yeah. that was pretty much us trying to work out the the hot dog uh, ratio. It's here. a sacrifice we're willing to make. Okay. We'll, we'll give okay. it a shot. This is not an issue. Uh, so beautiful views uh the the yacht uh, yachts are here in the mm -hmm. background yeah uh this is kind of quintessential milwaukee summer yeah. right yeah. yeah it's it's awesome like when before i started working here i didn't know that this view of the city existed i had never you know you turn kind of left at that collectivo i'm sorry right at the collectivo uh, going north and you, you don't really know that this is here and this view is here and i was like oh my gosh this is beautiful i mean it's really that? relaxing too like i think that people might not realize that like if you just needed to take a break this is the perfect spot yeah, to day. just grab well. a bite to eat have an awesome beer mm. have some great scenery and just chill like, these are great chill vibes here oh yeah Qu come no for uh, i love uh, that oh uh, no you guys are open all day yeah so oh we're open wednesday uh through sunday um 11 to 8. Uh, we have live music on Sundays as well, four to seven. Um, so like you said, just enjoy the chill vibe, just relax. We have Adirondack chairs for you. And just like have a beer with the most beautiful compliment. That's the city of Milwaukee, right? Oh man, it's 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 absolutely amazing. And then not only that, we've got uh, you've got the picnic table set up. There's indoor seating. Mm -hmm. You got some backyard games out here yeah. too. Yeah. So a little Connect Four, a little yeah. uh, bags, a little some fun to have, fun to be had. Yes, yes. So we have uh, we have cornhole or bags, depending on um, what you, what you call it's it. It's bags. I, I I say cornhole. <laughs> I went to college in Ohio, and oh, so it's sorry. that debate already been had. <laughs> yeah. All it's, right. It's been had. It's okay. It's bags. Okay, so we yeah. have some bags on deck. We got giant uh, Connect Four. We have giant Jenga. Um, basically, any yard game. We made it giant, and it's here. So you can come <laughs> hang out, uh, bring the kids, bring the dogs, uh, bring the cats, and you know, have a great time. Uh, my uh, in my brain, I keep going back to lobster roll. Mm, mm -hmm. Tell me more. Yeah, certainly. So this is something that we feature on the weekends. It's kind of an exclusive item. So it's a walking lobster roll. Yeah. So you're familiar with like a walking taco, right? Absolutely. So this is kind look, of like our oh um, our great. lakeside version, our oceanside version Dive here. Um, so it's going to be salt and vinegar chips. Uh, we do a little Old Bay uh, mayo drizzle on that. We have some knuckle and claw meat. Uh, and then uh, some diced celery, hit it with a little bit of Old Bay and some lemon, mm -hmm. and you got yourself a walking lobster roll. I love it. So It's really bad. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll eat it. You oh, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate you don't that. Have to, I'll eat it for you. Uh, anything in particular pair perfectly with that? Which uh, certain beer? I saw you have Spotted Cow on tap. You've got a couple other uh, varieties on tap. Yeah, certainly. So we're always rotating. Um, you know, I order kegs for the week and we just kind of pop them on as they blow. So every time you come in, there's going to be something different. For this in particular, I'd probably recommend something a little bit lighter, like a nice crispy Pilsner, something like that. Uh, oh, we yeah. just recently had Tidal Town Boathouse on. Super delicious. Uh, can't go wrong with that. That's a must. And then uh, uh, in the lineup, we, you're drinking the Sprecher root beer. Yeah. Uh, on the lineup of, of drinks to be had here at the beer garden also uh, mm -hmm. is for those who aren't about the beer, but mm -hmm. they still want to have a little fun. Yeah. This guy. Oh. Slushy boozy no. drinks. Yeah. <laughs> Slushy boozies, right? Yeah, yeah, certainly. So we got boozy slushies. <laughs> uh, we have old fashioned lemonade and then a rotating flavor. You can spike them. We have a uh, bunch of different uh, liquor options, also local. We Everything you're saying is perfect. Yeah, <laughs> we feature uh, Central Standard Distillery in our uh, uh, boozy slushies. Love Central Standard. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. They actually, we do their door county cherry with mm. uh with our lemonade slushy and oh. it is insane i have to try it Josh, yeah i need yes. to try it i know i figured i actually uh, at the end of the the podcast you
would just leave me behind and go yeah. get beer. I have never done that. Yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> nice, nice. Uh, I, w I wanted to also point out that, you know, in the summers in Milwaukee are obviously the best, mm -hmm. but a lot of times people just come down to the lakefront and they're not staying in one place. This is a great place to just add on your stop. Oh yeah. As you're kind of just going down the lakefront. 100%. It's not something where you have to even come down here and plan your whole day mm -hmm. around here, but if you're stopping at yeah. one of the other places, maybe you're stopping at the art museum, something else. Hitting the swans. Yeah. The swans. In the pond. You know, Doing going some to kiting, the kiting. Beach, Whatever it is. Yeah. This should definitely be a stop on everyone's plan because this is this is such a chill, awesome little place to stop. It's really great. Thank oh, you. Yeah, I appreciate great. that. Uh, yeah, you easily grab a bubbler bike or a, one of yes. the lime scooters, zip on yeah. over here. You uh, can make it a crawl, a lakefront crawl. You can hit, you know, just head down Lincoln Memorial. There's, you know, at least another beer garden. You got Bradford Beach, the Tiki Bar there. You got Collectivo to, you know, get a little caffeine on the way. Love yeah. It. So you uh, you day. said you you've recently moved back to Milwaukee. Yeah. Uh, obviously, um, I mean, I think it's obvious that the Roundhouse is your favorite place. Oh to be. gosh, oh gosh. Uh, but uh, so if someone's coming into town, they got relatives coming in, yeah. your tourists coming in. Where are you recommending? What's what a couple of your go-to spots? Yeah, certainly. So I love to do this. I have a lot of uh, family and friends that come visit. Um, the Lakefront Brewery tour is always on my list. Mm -hmm. That is just such a clutch time. Love that. Um, Milwaukee Public Market, of course, great way to showcase the city. And then my favorite. Uh, Breakfast spot, Blue's Egg. Have you guys been? Of course. Yes. Oh yeah, man, yeah. yes. Staple. Killer, killer. Do you have a, a, is there a certain dish you go after? I, I actually do. I always get like the. It's like that seafood scramble. Nice, dude. That's a good yeah. One. <laughs> with the, and then you have to upgrade to the loaded uh, loaded browns. Um, it's amazing. Yeah, I, yeah. I uh, love that spot. A big breakfast person. And I feel like Bartolotta's doesn't have breakfast anywhere, so I can say that. <laughs> you can say it? I can say what that. What about the Roundhouse? Oh, you know what? Special yeah, brunch. Yeah, I'm hearing ideas. I think okay. we can do a special brunch You know, brunch we actually day. do have Bloody Mary's and uh, canned mimosas. Okay. So. So, Bloody Mary, but you have breakfast food. Yeah, okay. you said Bloody Mary, and then uh, you said you didn't have breakfast. You're so right. Uh, and I'm I also, forgot. By the We're way, in Milwaukee. I, I'm also a firm believer that bratwurst and hot dogs are sausages, and therefore breakfast sausages. You know what? I I'm, I am so sorry. I, <laughs> forgive me. It's okay. Forgive my transgression. Yeah, That's thank it. you. I appreciate yeah. that. I wanted to also talk about, you know, you're right here by the marina. Mm -hmm. How often are you seeing, you know, people coming in and, you know, or going out on their boat that stop in here first? Because that's the other thing that you think about yeah. is, you know, okay, we got to pack, you know, the cooler. We got to pack all this stuff before we go out. Or you could just have a good meal before you even get your boat in the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. So we definitely try to cater to boaters as much as we can. Uh, we have 12 packs to go. Oh, nice. um, we have growlers that you can fill up, which oh, are great. So it. take a fresh growler on the boat. Um, that sounds like a fantastic day. Can I get a growler of the Central Standard Door County Cherry Lemonade? <laughs> uh, <laughs> you know what? I have to price that out. Okay. Uh, and it, you know, but I'm open to it. Yes. Yeah, for yes. sure. What if, he, what if he just took the entire slushy machine? Slu it's, it's, heavy. Awesome? It's, a, it's a heavy. It's a heavy. Heavy machine. It's a heavy machine. I'll We're try. big guys. We can handle it. Yeah. 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 All right. I'll, I'll, where can I invoice? Where can I invoice you? Visit Milwaukee? That's right. That's yeah. right. Okay. Good All right. Visit Sounds Milwaukee. good. Yeah. Sounds good. Uh, so uh, we didn't mention we're, we're here at McKinley uh, Marina. You've got mm -hmm. some great swag. The, shir the oh, shirt thanks. And, thanks. And, uh, hats. Yeah. Love it. Uh, and uh, it's kind of a, a, a mini icon of the city, the marina. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. it's, it's in our opening credits. Yes, it is. Of the show. Oh, I saw that. Yeah. The Did cool sign. Yeah. They took it down for the construction, but I so hope it comes back up. Yeah. So don't worry. We help, we have it. Oh, so we'll put it back. Up. Okay, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah I love actually it. Came That's right. We took it down. Yeah, and we we're like, we don't want anything. So the legacy this. must preserve. It's the yeah. coolest yeah. sign. It's yeah. the coolest yeah. sign. Yeah. Uh, but it, uh, again, just it's such a great addition. Uh, we we appreciate uh, Barlato Group for putting the the beer garden up here. Beer gardens iconic to Milwaukee. Mm -hmm. Uh, there's so many great uh, places to go for a beer garden, so it's great to see a little new, little new take on it, yeah. a brand new location. Uh, something I think everybody should come explore. Thank I you. I completely agree. Thank you so much for having us. I need to eat. Oh and yeah. More importantly, I gotta go try that slush. Well, you know, it, it is what it is. <laughs> I mean, if I have to stay here and drink Cheers, beer, guys. I will. Cheers to that. Awesome. Uh, man, what a beautiful day here at McKinley Marina, Roundhouse Beer Garden, operated by the Bartolotta Group, and man, it's it's been a blast. It's been so much fun. This food is so good, uh, 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 like really surprising. Yeah, would it be wrong to say it's too good? For 
look, a lot of people are gonna go, okay, yeah, I get it. It's just like a little place to get snacks. No, like this stuff's really good. Look at the size of this pretzel. The pretzel's huge. The hot dog's amazing. The, the sauces brat. were all really Obviously, good. Obviously, you really enjoyed the drinks. Well, they had a lot. You gotta try them all. <laughs> you realize that you've gone uh, a threefold here. You have three, two beers, and a slushy. This slushy, by oh, the way. Look at this. And lobster roll. Lobster. This is how, this is the type of service you this get is great. at the Roundhouse. This is so good. You it's, know, I was really hoping that I could eat that. Yeah, totally, man. Look, so the point is, is that this has just been, it's so much fun to be here. Um, As I said, it's really chilled. No, the no, The vibes Josh, are Josh, great. I, yeah. I don't think you heard me. I was really hoping I could eat that one, the lobster roll. Oh. Like, I thought it would be perfect with the pretzel. And like... Yeah. Because I think you've already had some. and then, I don't know what you're talking about. Like, Look, it's my so turn. The point is, is that it's, it's, you know, everything was great. It's, it's great out here. The Roundhouse is awesome. More people should make time to stop here, to, all right? Yeah, to eat the lobster roll. Yeah. All right, man, well, I'll see you later. Yeah, hey, we came here together.